Good morning guys, welcome to the vlog. Today's the day after Halloween, and as you can see by our faces, we are tired today. Um, yes, you are, you, you are tired. It's a little late, we've gotten a late start to the day, but I was just trying to enjoy getting some extra rest. I think the kids were tired, like Jackson was really tired since he went to sleep later. So um, he slept in a little later. Thank the Lord. Would you say, babe, that it's a pretty day? Yeah. Well, let's hope it stays that way. So today we have our family photos, and it's the first year ever like that we're getting professional photos done. The girl that's doing my photos is the mom friend that I made over here in Virginia. So she's a photographer. She has really beautiful work. So we're supporting her business this year, and we're finally getting family photos. You guys, I've never seen Joe so excited about anything in his entire life. <laughs> he is like not. I can't it. You can't contain the excitement. <laughs> he like hates photos, but you're gonna be a good sport, like you were yesterday for Halloween. Photos are like a stressful thing here in this family, so we figured maybe it would be easier if we finally you know had somebody else take them so the one good piece of advice that i've gotten from one of you guys on instagram is to not really worry too much if like the kids are smiling um to just focus on having a good time because if you're stressed that you know they're not smiling then you're not gonna have a smile on your face so we're gonna try to take that today into the photos but first we'll be hanging out here um so yeah we're gonna do some vlogging um joseph can you go down to the freezer please get some butcher box cakes so they can thaw out, please um so yes today's video is sponsored by butcher box so i'm gonna have joe get some steaks we'll have them over here at least in the fridge so we can have them later tonight for dinner so once he gets them up then we'll talk a little bit about them all right so these are the ones that joe brought up this is these are filet mignons right grass-fed filet mignon so we'll have this for dinner tonight that sounds delicious so yeah obviously this isn't the first time i share butcher box with you guys we've been using them now for months and months it's probably been over a year since i started working with them i love the fact that it's so convenient the meat comes to your door um the thing with butcher box is just you're getting the best quality meat like they source from farmers and fishermen that like only have like the best quality stuff so you're getting like 100 percent grass-fed um beef and stuff like that so really good tasting food i'm gonna switch over really quick so you guys can see what came in my box this month because i unboxed it like the other night because it was shipped like later on in the day so i did the custom box this time around so let's open this up and see what kinds of cuts i got this is organic boneless skinless chicken breast you get um three of these and like these are like good meals for joe and i then we have some grass-fed beef ribeye steak and we've got some more steak too i did get burgers this time around i love their burgers these are 100 percent grass-fed grass-finished beef patties their burgers are really really good highly recommend the burgers then i got some bacon because i love their bacon too and this is whole 30 approved so if you're doing like whole 30 the butcher box bacon is really good for that i think this is filet mignon down here yeah we got some filet mignon and then these are some of their which ones are these the just like a strip loin like a sirloin strip steak and then what we also have in here is a whole turkey so the promo that they have going on right now is you get a free whole turkey in your first box so this is perfect for thanksgiving so yes jackson has joined me but he wanted to let you guys know that the offer right now that they have going on if you guys use my link down below in the description box is you get a whole turkey in your first box so if you want to already start prepping for thanksgiving and you want to make sure you get a turkey that's a nice way to do it another thing that i always tell you guys that's great about butcher box is that it's very flexible too so like it's not the kind of thing that you're going to get stuck into like you can cancel anytime you can also choose which box you want so if you want one that has like all beef you can get an all beef box if you want an all chicken box you can get an all chicken box i usually do the custom box because it lets me pick which cuts of meat i want so that's like the most appealing to me i'll get a little bit of a mix like you saw like i'll do a little bit of burgers and then some chicken and some steak so that's the one that I usually prefer. And then you can also pick like how often you want it sent to you. So if you want it like every four weeks, you can do every four weeks or every six weeks, stuff like that. So when we get back from the family photos, I'll have Joe cook those on the grill and that'll be our dinner. And like when you think about it too, because like sometimes people ask me about the price. Hi, you're gonna have candy from last night. <laughs> when people ask me about the price, like the cost of one of those boxes, like if you think about it, if you go to a fancy dinner and you have like the best 
steak, like oh, great yeah. quality steak. The entire box would be the cost of like one fancy good steak dinner. So that's kind of how I justify it. Like that is our fancy, like Joe and I having a date night. Like we're having filet mignons. That would cost us over a hundred bucks at a restaurant. Yeah. But thank you as always to ButcherBox for sponsoring. Remember to use my code and the offer, everything will be in the description box, guys. Okay, 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 I got it. You want a crunch. Here, you can have a piece of candy, but then we have to eat our breakfast, okay? Joseph, what are you doing over here? <laughs> You're fixing <laughs> the Klingons. <laughs> Why, they were not up to your standards? Do you like the um, mismatch here of the words? Like this this broke. That broke? I think it was like here for this part of the house. Is this like bothering your your OCD tendencies? <laughs> well then what are you doing? This is just fun for you? Maybe. Therapeutic? Maybe. Very well. All right, the kiddos have eaten their breakfast. I got a little bit of computer work done because I'm like behind on my work with everything that's been going on. So I need to like get focused, get to it. Um, I wanted to show you some of the things that came in the other day I placed a Target order because like their jammies were 20% off. So I think I showed you when I ordered or when I picked this one up for Riley at Target. I think I got Riley's in store, but they didn't have Jackson's size. So I ordered it and I just love this. So now they have matching jammies. Um, we're doing Christmas mini photos with my friend who's also taking our fall photos. So I have to see like what her backdrop is so that I can like coordinate them. But Regardless, they have matching Christmas jammies, which I think is so cute. And then these um, are just like the Target brand ones. Where's like the tops? So they had a set of like girl PJs, which came in a set of two, but it's like the tops and the bottoms. So I have like PJs everywhere. So this is a print for the girls. It's like you get two jammies, Santa and the reindeers, and then the matching bottom. So that's like the girl version and then the boy version is like this so they have like two sets technically of matching christmas jammies or three sets really so if you need jammies i would hop on those before they start selling out as we get closer to christmas and then speaking of christmas stuff too remember when i shared like that chatty vlog where i told you guys that i wanted to make sure that this year we also keep the focus of christmas right keep the focus on jesus on what the holiday is really about so from the place that i get my devotionals that i love they had a couple things that I picked up. So I got this devotional that's all about Advent. It's called Waiting for the Savior. So leading up to Christmas, the four weeks before Christmas, I'll be reading through this devotional, which I'm very excited to read through. Um, I'm also thinking of getting like an Advent wreath to put somewhere in the house with the candles. So I'm excited about this. And then I got for the kids, they had this really pretty book, which I already read through you guys, and I cried reading this. Like it was just such a very like not i don't want to say like dumbed down way but like you know for kids to understand really what the meaning of christmas is all about and it was like a pretty book to look through but i cried reading through it because you really like really understand like what what happened and why we celebrate christmas so i liked this book everything from this place from daily grace coat is so affordable to like this devotional was like 10 bucks. The kids book I think was maybe $8. And I do wanna tell you that I finally realized that I have a code for them. Like I have not, not a discount code, but I have an affiliate link for them. Like all the times that I've shared my devotionals, um, I didn't have like a way of making commissions from that. I didn't think that they were a site that I could make um, like affiliate links from, but they are. So now if you buy any of the stuff from my links, I get a cut from you know like the commissions from them so very excited about that because you guys know like i love this stuff like i buy it all the time so i would definitely appreciate it if you buy them you know to use my links but great gifts for the holiday season and a great way to kind of prepare yourself for christmas so got those this is also a great resource this is um like a family devotional waiting for jesus the family tree of jesus and the hope for christmas so my thought is that Every day um, during dinner time, Joe and I can read this to the kids. It gives you like a little scripture to read and then a little, you know, passage to read and kind of, again, focusing on Jesus. And then these are little Advent cards. So they're just little cards that we can read. Um, is it one per week? Yeah, it looks like it's one per week. So this week, week one, it's all about hope. And then it gives you like a memory verse. And then this one is about peace. So just, you know, like little things like that that we can do during the holiday season to keep the focus on 
what it's really about. So if you're also into that, I thought I would share. What are you doing over here? Yeah. Riley's making patterns with Jackson's color sorting toy. Yeah. This is something we've been working on, the patterns, green. which is great for her. Green, red, green, red, green, red. Let me see if I can do that. Yellow. Blue. Yellow. Blue. Good job, Mama. Joseph, you've never looked more attractive than handing me packages. <laughs> Thank you. I am so stoked for this. This is Olive and June. They sent me their new um their new collection for the nail polishes. I'm so excited about that. Sorry, looks like I've got more things to show you. I was gonna go put the other stuff upstairs, but this, this like made my day. This is the Olive and June holiday collection. So I have um, a code for it. Oh, my goodness, guy. Oh, his, his thing is stuck. Stop pulling, stop pulling. Jackson, stop. Stop hit me in the Okay, let, let's try this again. Bubble wrap. Okay, I will give you some bubble wrap. Can you guys let me open my package? Here's some bubble wrap. Bubble Let me show you guys the colors. They are so nice. But if you need like something either to gift yourself or to gift someone else, these um systems are great. I think my code gets you 20% off of like the Manny system or the Petty system or the whole system. I will be talking about them when I do like a gift guide for women that I'm gonna do soon because I think it makes a great gift. Oh my god, these colors are beautiful. So these are the colors for winter. Look at these like metallic-y ones. Really pretty red. These are all super pretty. And then this is the box that comes like if you get the Manny system. And then it comes with like the nail polish remover that I'm obsessed with. It's like a pot. You just put your fingers in it and it takes off your nail polish. And then I've got the like top coat, I'm sure. And then you get... I want to open this, but here you have like the cuticle, like there's like other little things yeah. that you get. So I'm going to put this in my room. Jackson, what are you doing? Other than just being a grumpy dude. Did I tell you guys that he's getting, I think I told you that he's getting his bottom tooth, like the fang, whatever you call him, the canine. So he's been a little fussy lately. The little fang, whatever, the canine. What was it? Maybe it was three or four nights ago, he was up like in the middle of the night and like we had to like settle him quite a bit, which he hardly ever does that, only when he's getting like teeth in. So it looks like his teeth are coming in. Why are you so mad with that watch? He wants to put it in like his little cars and take it around. Is that your new favorite toy? I have to obviously watch him because I'm scared that he's going to, um. He's gonna strangle himself with it. Don't yell. All right, this is your daily reminder not to spend a fortune on toys. Jackson just wants to be pulled in this box like a little sled. I don't have the energy to go around the entire house. So we're just gonna do this for a little while. You like that? You want that? I'm going. Okay. Ready? What? I'm gonna ship him to Mimi's house? Okay. Go. Get in the bowl. So we can ship you to Mimi's house. <laughs> Is that fun? Is that fun? Yeah. Okay, I you know, I have to start getting ready for our pictures. What? <laughs> look here, get a get a car or something. Where's your car? Here, look, make it like a little ramp. Whee! All right, guys, so I just hopped in and out of the shower. I'm gonna let my hair dry a little bit, and then I can um, blow dry it. Or, I don't know, I have to blow dry it, but I also want to curl it. So I've got, I still got stuff to do. I'm like panicking, because like, what time is it? It's one o'clock. I still have three hours, so I should be good. But remember, like, as a mom, when you're doing family photos, not only do you have to get yourself ready, you also have to get your tiny humans ready, and also sometimes your husband ready. So um, I still have a lot to do. So I'm gonna do my hair. I put on a little bit of my Tula moisturizer just so that when I then do my makeup, like it's not like all dried up like it was this morning. So did that, a little bit of skin prep, and then I need to do, I'm gonna try to do false um, falsies today, which I don't normally do, but for pictures, 
it's one of the things that helps to like you know give you more of like a done up look so i'm gonna try to do that but that could take a while because i'm not a pro so gonna do that i ironed i steamed my dresses yesterday well i'm only gonna use one but if you guys have been on instagram you guys have seen the dilemma with the dresses because i've been going back and forth on outfits on what to wear so i'm probably gonna wear i just like poke my eye out with the hanger probably gonna wear this brown dress um you guys are gonna see everyone's outfits eventually but I really liked this green dress, but there's this green dress that I love and I'll link them both for you because they were both Amazon finds, very um, affordable, like $37 for each of them. But since we're gonna be outside and like the like foliage and stuff, I think brown might be better since like green, there's gonna be like lots of different kinds of green. I don't know, we've been going, we've been going through it on Instagram. So I'm gonna get dressed in one of those, have to finalize the kids' outfits, which I think for the most part I have finalized. I still have like all the Halloween stuff I have to put away. This house is, is a wreck, like always, but I have, you know, a lot of back-to-back -back stuff. So I got in the shower, I shaved, left my eyebrows a bit, made sure that that was looking good. So let's just get to it. I'm gonna put you guys down because I've got a lot to do and, um, then I can start getting the kids dressed. Okay, a million years later, um, I had to take a break because I had to blow dry my hair. And then I had to like, the kids were getting their um, food downstairs. And then I had to wet Riley's hair so that her curls would come back. So Riley already had a quick little bath. We're gonna let her hair dry so it's curly. We're wearing our robes that we wore. <laughs> My sister's wedding, do you like that robe? Yeah? She's insisting on putting Halloween socks on, which is not gonna be part of her outfit. But um, yeah, that's what she wants to wear right this second. <laughs> Not for family photos, Why? but when we get home, you can wear them, okay? No, these are really cute. They are really cute. I want to wear cute socks. So that's the current situation. Um, Jackson is taking oh. a nap, thank God. Um, and then I'm gonna start now doing my curls. I wanted to wait till I had gotten her out of the shower to do my curls, um, and then do my makeup, all of that, because I, I have like less. Than, I have like an hour, an hour and twenty minutes maybe to go, and I still have a lot to do. So let's um. move it. So we are getting ready to leave the house. I'm not even putting on my dress until I get there because I don't want it to get wrinkled. Same with Riley. I'm not putting her in her little jumper until she gets there um, because that's the last thing I need, right? So I've got my dress here, Jackson's real sweater that he's gonna wear here, and then Riley's jumper. I'm gonna take that in the car. A backup outfit, God forbid, Riley spills something on her shirt or something. Um, got that and then Jackson has the sweater that he's wearing now as like a backup. And then this is my bag I'm gonna take with like my makeup. And that should be it. I did my makeup myself. Um, I'm gonna do lips. My lipstick is down in my diaper bag. Tried to do the falsies. I don't know, I'm like still not a thousand percent happy with them, but better I think than what I probably thought. I thought it was gonna be a total disaster. At least maybe it'll just make my eyes pop a little bit. So this is how Riley is going to the location <laughs> until we uh, we get there and start shooting. But let's go guys. All right guys, we are in the car. We are gonna be heading now to the location. I hope I made this seem stressful <laughs> because it has been very stressful. Um, we're trying to recollect our calm because you know, the kids were screaming, Joe was getting irritated. So <laughs> I'm hoping that it's the rest of the shoot- It's not recollect, it's recollect because it disappeared. It completely disappeared. <laughs> our calm was completely gone. So we're trying to recollect. I think it's still recollect, but whatever. We're trying to get our calm back because it is gone. So, um, again, I'm gonna change. Huh? 
that ship, ship set, sail <laughs> set sail about two years ago. <laughs> Shut up. So anyway, um, once we get there, I'll change everybody and then we can start shooting. All right, we made it here. Look how pretty the spot is. This is my friend Laura. You don't have to say hi if you don't want to. <laughs> You just peek in there, but look how pretty. The day is gorgeous. Riley's all set. Jackson's all set. It's gonna be good, Dada. Yes, Joseph is wearing pants. <laughs> and when we were on Instagram, I was only sharing his um his sweater. Yeah. So then everybody's like, so I guess Joe's not wearing pants. That he's going so commando. <laughs> Somebody said, oh, he's gonna be in tidy whitey. <laughs> <laughs> You're not in tidy whiteys. <laughs> <laughs> Riley, look at Miss Laura. Oh, look at Can you do a big laugh? <laughs> That's how she smiles with the big laugh. Yeah. Well, don't fall in the creek. <laughs> Put your hands like this. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Beautiful. That's how I sleep in my bed. <laughs> She's at it. <laughs> Alright guys, we are done. We have two crying children. <laughs> that was so much fun. I'm so glad we got to do that with my friend. But Jackson did not cooperate. Like if we got one decent smiling photo where he wasn't crying or had um, a piece of candy in his hand or the pig. The pig is gonna be in all our photos, Tada. That'll be a win, huh? Oh, the, the pig like disappeared? Well, yeah, he had the little toy pig in his hand for a while. I'm sure that we got some pretty shots, but um, yeah, it was, it was rough with the children, but I'm glad we did it. I'm super happy. And then she said she'll have like a teaser up um, probably tomorrow and then it takes three weeks for the photos to come back, so. I will definitely share them once they are up. That was good, glad we did it now that it's over. <laughs> All right, you guys, we are home. I'm gonna go get out of this dress. Um, Joe's gonna start cooking. I don't even know if you guys saw like my dress full length today. So this is the dress that I wore for the photos and I really liked it. I think it was the right choice for the photos that we did. It's got like two slits. It's got one here and then one on the other side. It was very comfy, I think very fall appropriate and from Amazon, like you would probably never know that it was from Amazon. So really liked this one. The other green dress that I was like in between was very pretty, but I think it really would have clashed with like a lot of the green stuff that we were shooting with in the background. So um, maybe I'll save that one for like winter photos, Christmassy photos, but thanks to all of you guys for helping me figure out my outfit. So let's get comfy and then we can eat dinner and all of that. All right, we're sitting down to have dinner. And this is the filet that Joe made us. Thank you, Dada. You're welcome think we deserve a nice good meal after <laughs> the event that was the family photos. Do you agree? You think so? Jackson's here too. Riley insisted on a spooky dinner, so that's why the lights are off. So yeah, we're gonna enjoy our dinner and then I've got a lot of work to do after the kids go to bed, but I'm glad that I was able to take you guys along on our day, on our family photos. If you have questions for me, if there's anything I can help you guys with family photo related, let me know. Um, I'm also gonna have Laura's info, my friend's info down below in the description box. If you guys are in the Nova area, um, you wanna maybe shoot with her or like ask her about her rates or whatever, you guys can um, DM her or email her. But that is it. Again, thank you to ButcherBox for sponsoring today's video. Remember, if you order, your first box, you get that whole turkey. So, you know, get ready for Thanksgiving. Be prepped and ready um, and enjoy some really good tasting meat. So, I love you guys. Thanks for being here. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys. Oh, okay. Bye, guys.